What up, everybody? Too good here. Um, this is gonna be a very quick, hopefully quick review. Um, today I went and saw the Battle of the Gods. That's right, DBZ Dragon Ball. Um, theatrical release. The English dub came out today. It's a very limited release for the next three days. I think it's today's Tuesday. It's like Tuesday, Thursday, and Wednesday. It's a limited release. It's only these three days for now. Um. So yeah, see why you can. Went to my local movie theater, had it. The movie theater was packed. You know, it was barely any seats in there. So yeah, good thing I came early or early enough to get me a nice seat right there in the middle of the um, middle of the the back seats or whatever, so I can have a nice view. If you come to the movie theater, please come, please come on time, people early, at least ten minutes, please. Is it really that hard? People coming in and walking fifteen minutes late. Come on, man. Where you bringing it? Um, but yeah, the movie was excellent. I enjoyed it. every second of it. Literally, I enjoyed every second of it. Um, this is not gonna be a review of the movie because most of you watching this review have probably already seen the movie via the Japanese release with subtitles. So, like I have. So the story wasn't new, but it was such a new experience. You know, f first off, it was my first DVD experience in the theater. Which I was already like amazing. Usually I'm just watching it on TV. Um, I even turned it down a little bit. Um, but yeah, just like the English dub version, it, the dub is incredible. Um, they did Hunter Mission did a phenomenal job with the dub. There were a couple of weird parts though. Like the one that stuck out to me was like there's a scene where there's something on the wall in Japanese, I think it is, and they have like subtitles at the top. It looks really tacky. But I understand they really can't do anything about that. So, actually there's just a couple of sections where that happens, where they have to put subtitles. Kind of looks tacky, but... Like, just like somebody put Windows Movie Maker edit, and it just put the words there. But it looks really kind of tacky. But it didn't really affect my movie experience at all, because it wasn't that long of an instance where that occurred. You know, very short. Um... Voices are awesome, you know, all the classy voices there, Bulma, Vegeta, my man Vegeta, the best character in DBZ, I don't care what nobody says, all about Prince Saiyan Vegeta. Um, Goku, excellent, everybody does a great job with their voice acting. Um, story, I'm not gonna, like I said, I'm not gonna uh, go over the story, um, because this is a, just a review of the, the English version. Uh, but if I were to give a quick review, I really like the story. Battle of the Gods story. Really like really enjoyed it. Thought it was a great movie. And I still think it is a great movie. If you are a DBZ fan, you need to see this movie. You need to see this movie before Funimation takes it out of the theatrical release. So that means you need to see it by Thursday. Which by the time you see it, it's going to be Wednesday. So you need to see it by today or tomorrow. Seriously. Um, yeah, if you're a fan of DBZ, you need to see this movie. It is unacceptable for you to do anything otherwise. Come on, people. It, tickets... $12 for me. Um, it was really $10, dollars even $2 convenience fee, whatever. And then popcorn, I guess that's. I didn't buy popcorn because I knew it was going to be a short movie. So, I was just like, eh. But yeah, um, the movie, the dub was excellent. Funimation, like I said, did a great job. Um, art looks amazing. The visuals, this best DBZ looking um, piece of anime looking to date. I don't think anybody really can argue that. Art looks really up to date, looks really modernized, looks fantastic. Sound, it's good. You know, the movie doesn't have, the movie's DBZ movie doesn't have that Bruce Falcon that we all know and love, you know, but it's still good. Um, the movie is still, it's, it's the same movie, like I said, as the Japanese one, but the, the stuff, everything is the same. The funny parts are still funny, the, the intense parts, are, the intense parts are still intense. Like, everybody in the diesel was just, including myself, I was dying, I was dying laughing. When Vegeta started dancing. <laughs> oh man. He just started dancing. So out of character. Why do you always have my Kira, why are you always embarrassing my, my man and Vegeta? Um, yeah, that was hilarious. So a lot of, this movie has a lot of comedy. If you haven't already seen it already. It's 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 a pretty entertaining movie as far as comedy goes. It will have you laughing. Um, another part, especially at the end when Goku uh, after he done fight Lord Beerus, he's um he was telling how he saw Vegeta like Hulk up basically when he was fighting Beerus. He's like, my Goku's like, 
Vegeta, I saw you did it. Yes, I saw you did it. Um, in case you saw your little bit. Like, My bomba! And he kind of read it. That was, that was hilarious. Not a funny part of this movie. Um, but yeah, so. Like I said, I'm not going to try, try to make this too long. Just want to get kind of straight to the point. Like I said, if you are a DBZ fan, this is a must go watch. You must go watch this. Find your local theater. Find which theater is playing it. Go and watch it right now. Or as soon as possible, obviously. Because you only have, like I said, a limited amount of days to see this. So, see it. You don't know how long it's going to take to get out on DVD. Or when they're going to do the next showing. So, just see it now. Um, if you're trying to get into DBZ, um, you will wait to the game, buddy. But, if you're just, you know, testing the waters out, this is an okay place to start. I don't think it's going to disappoint you at all. Even though, eh, you probably prefer better start off with some of the anime episodes, but if you're just looking for a movie to get in DBZ, just go ahead and check this out, it's probably not going to be that expensive, at least for me, I guess it depends theater to theater, but it's worth the investment in my opinion, go with a friend if you feel, um, feel hesitant, go with a, maybe a, a fan of DBZ, so he might can uh, just point out certain things, explain things when you don't understand, stuff like that, but yeah, overall, this movie gets a five star well four out of five stars i'm not even gonna really i'm not even gonna rank it i, I really really like this dub really really like the movie <clears throat> so that's pretty much it um do like say dbc fans go check it out anime fans go check it out please oh do not pirate this movie or do not record this movie in the theater don't be a dick come on people i was sitting there and i was so upset this dude would just put out a camera fortunately didn't record the whole thing because i would have been like i would have been mad yeah, don't don't record this. I mean, we know we know everybody wants to see this movie because it's the English dub, but don't record it. You know, don't be that don't be that guy. You know, just go to the theater. Stop being so cheap. You know, look at this. Just just go to the theater and see it. No, I, I guess it's instant we don't have access to the theater, yeah, yeah, yeah. But come on, don't pirate. I mean, you can avoid pirating. Um, yeah, that's it for this video. Make it quick, short, and sweet, and to the point. Battle of the Gods gets an excellent rating from me. Too good, I'm out hoping. Too good, I'm out hoping you enjoy this review. Peace.